The Quran has provided the world with the most powerful source of regulation. And Islam places the status of women and the family at the most precious and central unit of the society and has laid down laws to preserve its sanctity. Let us take another example. You can travel throughout the Muslim world as I have done. And of course, you see tragedy, you see deviation. We see Muslims being away from Islam, being negligent in their conduct. But the family, the Muslim family is still intact. In the Western world, when a person becomes 60 years old or 70 years old and they can no longer function, let me tell you what happens to them in China. In China, they're put to sleep because they have something in China called zero population. So there's no toleration for old people. When they get to a point where they have no function any longer, they put them to sleep like dogs. In China, the rule is one child for every family. And if you have two children, you are put in prison and you and your wife are both anesthetized and your ability to have children is taken out. What do they call that? Vasectomy, sterilized. This is China. So what has the family become in the modern world? And what is the family in Islam? The family in Islam is the most sacred unit. Without the family, there's no society. Without the family, there's no sanctity. The Messenger of Allah Sallallahu Alaihi Wasallam has placed respect for the mother and father as the highest respect next to Allah Subhanahu Wa Ta'ala. A man asked the Prophet Sallallahu Alaihi Wasallam, Ya Rasulullah, Ayy A'mal Afdal. So the Messenger of Allah Sallallahu Alaihi Wasallam, when he was asked, what action is the best and what is the most excellent in the sight of Allah Subhanahu Wa Ta'ala, he said prayer in its proper time. And after that, respect for your two parents. And after that, struggling in the way of Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala. And because the family has this value in Islam, still you find in the Muslim countries, the children respectful of their parents. The Prophet sallallahu said, he is not of us who has no softness, gentleness towards the youth and has no respect for our elders. This is the family of Islam.